BNY Mellon is building an improved client experience, increasing efficiency and implementing new technologies to deliver smarter, simpler, safer solutions for its clients' financial services needs. We're joined by Lester Owen, Senior Executive Vice President and Head of Operations at BNY Mellon. Uh, he's responsible for leading the bank's global operations organization, supporting every stage of the investment life cycle. Welcome to Cybos TV, Lester. Now, you've been coming to Cybos for a decade now, over a decade. You've seen it all, but how has the conversation evolved over time? Well, you know, it's, what's quite interesting is if I think back um, when the first time I came, uh, we really was started with the payment evolution, right? It was all about security. It was all about you know, speed and execution. Uh, then we went to talking about resiliency, as actually I was on a resiliency committee just knowing the importance of, of the SWIFT network. And now a lot of the conversation is about innovation, right? About cyber and, and how do you continue to strengthen the core. Um, and you hear the words machine learning, artificial intelligence. You hear SWIFT talks about the API, um, GPI. So um, it has evolved over the, the last decade uh, for some positive reasons. So every Cybos is different each year. What are you hoping to take away from Cybos 2019? You know, when I think about it, um, I think about the clients first. Um, my opportunity to meet with clients, understand some of the things that they're doing strategically, sharing our journey with them, um, and helping them to understand some of the client experience, uh, which I think is uh, very important. I think some of the sessions that uh, Cybos holds, I think has been fantastic as well, uh, and understanding what, uh, what they're doing. We tend to be in the forefront of many of the initiatives, so I'm going to find that to be very rewarding um, as well. Now, you've been here many times before, but this is the first time with BNY Mellon. You've been here for six months, I think. What's impressed you? Yeah, well, you know, if I think back of the last six months, uh, number one is the people, uh, the, com the commitment, uh, the passion, I think first and foremost. I think second is what you talked about uh, earlier, and that is um, the, str the strategy, uh, the ability to invest in new technology, in order to, uh, to really help our client base. And let's stick with the theme of technology because obviously you, you're, you're at the, the job that you've been doing now for about six months, as Johnny said. So in terms of leveraging digital technologies, how are you going to use that to improve the client experience? Because that's what it's all about really at the end of the day, isn't it? Yeah, it's, it's a good question. Uh, you know, it tends to start with what we call data, you know, uh, and uh, making sure that we've got a real data strategy. The bank has really invested in building in some talented individuals in order to really build up what we call a global data uh, uh, strategy team. Uh, secondly, we have a whole host of projects underway, starting with our client servicing platform that we're looking to build. Uh, we're doing a lot of work in the client onboarding space uh, in order to reduce the amount of documentation that clients need to um, provide to us, as well as speed of execution uh, going forward. So, uh, you know, I can continue on, but that, that's some of the reasons that I really came to uh, BNY Mellon. We know at BNY Mellon processes around $2 trillion of payments globally each day. It's a big number, but how, how do you guys, um, how are you going to make the process simpler, would you say smarter and safer for your clients? More you know, if I start with safety, um, I first thing I think <coughs> about is the investment that we have in our cyber. You know, I think that's number one. Number two, and I'm sure people will be talking about it quite a bit this week, is cyber fraud and helping to educate clients on some of the things that we're doing. We're also looking to uh, <coughs> implement new technology to look at patterns for clients to help protect them as well as relates to their payment activity. Uh, that's number one. And number two is continuing to work with SWIFT um, as an example on some of the initiatives like the Global Payment Initiative <coughs> that gives us the ability to tr uh, provide clients with real-time information. And the third thing is what I talked about earlier and that is the introduction of a new client servicing platform. Mm. Plenty of challenges when you actually look at the broader picture, but in terms of the payment space, where are those challenges that you're seeing? And what is BMY Mellon doing to actually help clients navigate them? Because these are very, very choppy waters. Yes, it is. And um, I think the first thing is what I previously mentioned, that is one of the challenges is just data. Uh, you know, if you think about 
data is disseminated in so many different systems, so many different platforms, being able to consolidate data and provide client with instantaneous information is, is an aspiration and things that we want to do, but every firm really has the same challenges, and what we've done is to lay out a strategy that we think will be useful for our client base. Um, so I think that's really the, the biggest one. And the second challenge is, again, is, is the cyber fraud space and trying to get ahead of that. And I think the third is continuing to look at consistency across the network. When I think of ISO, you know, 2000 and 022, um, what they're trying to do is, uh, is standardization. And if we continue to do that, including in the real-time payment space, I think we're going to be a better industry for it. Well, we've got a full and exciting week ahead at Cybos again this year. Uh, I hope you enjoy it as much as you've enjoyed the last decade. Uh, Lester Owen, Senior Executive Vice President and Head of Operations at BNY Mellon. Thank you very much for joining us on Cybos TV. Thank you as well. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you.